हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज आईराधेश्वरन टेंपल इन दरासुरम नियर कुंभकोणम नियर द एंट्रेंस ऑफ दिस शिवा टेंपल इज नंदी मंडपम एंड हियर इज द बलिपीठम द सेवन म्यूजिकल स्टेप्स एज यू क्लाइम अप एंड डाउन यू कैन हियर दिस नोट्स दिस टेंपल वाज कंस्ट्रक्टेड बाय राजा राजा चोला टू इन 12th सेंचुरी The story of this temple is on the elephant of Lord Indra. Lord Indra's elephant Aravat was cursed by Rishi Durvasa and then the elephant Aravat came here and did tapasya to Lord Shiva and uh, Lord Shiva freed the elephant from its curse. The story of Aira Deshwaran is written on the walls of this temple and this temple is a paradise of art and architecture. Here on the walls and pillars you can see amazing small 1 inch sculptures. These are the entrance steps to the temple and here you can see the wheel and the horse as if this temple is on the chariot. On the steps and all around you can see small sculptures these are 1 inch 2 inch these sculptures are of lord ganesha lord indra fire air brahma and many more here near the entrance of the temple you can see these uh, amazing sculptures and each sculpture has a story Each sculpture is unique in its own way. These amazing sculptures are on all the pillars near the entrance before visiting Lord Shiva. The art and architecture of this temple is in Dravidian style. This temple is a paradise and a feast for the eyes of all the art lovers as it is an abundance of beauty and art. Here in this temple all around you can see beautiful mini sculptures. Here on this pillar you can see an extraordinary figure sculpture which has different poses and uh, it's a unique art of that time this type of extraordinary art is again coming back now in our time this is the sculpture of shiva and parvati On the ceiling also you can see beautiful small sculptures. The name of this temple Aradeshwaran came from the name of uh, the white elephant of Indra Airavat. Rishi Durvasa gave a garland of flowers to Lord Indra and Lord Indra gave this garland to his white elephant Airavat. The fragrance of the flowers attracted many bees and with this Uh, the aravat was very much disturbed so uh, the elephant threw away the garland rishi durvasa was very much angry when he came to know this here is lord shiva in uh, shivalinga form rishi durvasa cursed lord indra and aravat for their action they asked the forgiveness from rishi durvasa and asked him how to break the curse so the elephant came down to the earth the elephant became an ordinary elephant and it turned its color to the normal one and it lost its powers rishi durvasa had told to do tapasya to lord shiva so here the elephant came and did tapasya and there was a lake where it took bath after doing tapasya when lord shiva appeared he told to 
take bath in the lake which was here previously and as soon as it took bath in the lake it got its powers back and it also got turned into white elephant to its original color before going back to heaven the airavat the elephant of lord indra did abhishekam to lord shiva which is here in linga form the lake here in which the arava took bath is called yamatirtham Here this pillar is also a unique one with the combination of different animals elephant lion etc Now I am taking you around the temple and around the temple you can see very extraordinary and unique sculptures This sculpture is also a combination of different animals. Here you will be seeing a sculpture with the combination of two animals. This sculpture is the combination of cow and elephant. Extraordinary and amazing of that time. Beside this temple little away is Goddess Parvati's temple, which I'll show you soon in my coming up videos. I hope all the art lovers enjoyed seeing these uh, mini amazing sculptures. Do like, share, comment, and subscribe my channel, friends. I'll be coming up with more interesting videos on art, art techniques, tutorial style, fashion, and many more. Thank you. See you. Bye bye.